Study Session 1 Introduction Welcome to SOC 206 class. This course will give you an insight into diverse ways behaviors are organized in Africa towards the maintenance of the society. This course will equip you with the knowledge of Africa, its people, and the means they have developed to meet their needs and ensure continuity among their race. In this unit, you will be learning about the concept of social institutions. Emphasis will be placed on the meaning of social institution, the various forms of indigenous social institution in African context, and functions of social institutions. Learning outcomes. At the end of the lecture, students should be able to 1. Define and use correctly all of the keywords printed in bold. 2. Explain the importance of social institutions in a society. 3. Identify major types of social institutions. 4. Mention the basic functions of at least three social institutions. Meaning types and function of social institutions. The people of Africa. In sociology, the word people refers to a collectivity or group of individuals. The people of Africa are a group of persons of African descent. They have diverse ethnic affiliations, differing cultures and numerous languages. For example, we have the Oromos in Ethiopia and Kenya, the Hutus and Tutsis in Burundi and Rwanda, the Igbos, Yorubas and Alsas in Nigeria, the Madinkas in the Gambia, the Zulus in South Africa, and so on. The meaning of social institutions. Social institutions are the organized means through which a society develops to meet its basic needs. They are organized ways of doing things. Social institutions are generally agreed upon by members of a society. By agreeing on these things, members of each society use these to order their lives and enhance communal interactions. A social institution is one of the complex and integrated social norms organized around the preservation of social values. It is a system of organization that works to meet basic social needs and connects individual members of society to the larger culture. According to Etzin and Bakazin 2001, social institutions are social arrangements that channel behavior in prescribed ways in important areas of social life. Anthony Giddens 1984 defined social institutions as the more enduring features of social life. Social institutions serve as regulatory agencies, channeling behavior in culturally prescribed ways. Although social institutions are distinct aspects of culture, they are elements of culture. Feature of societies A distinctive feature of society is the existence of a number of institutions. Social institutions are the organized ways each society develops to meet their basic needs. Different forms of social institutions in Africa. The social institutions in Africa and other countries of the world are many. There are five basic social institutions on which society revolves. These are the marriage and family institutions, economic institutions and religious institutions. Others are the educational institutions and political institutions. A sixth one that will also be treated in this course 
is a legal institution. These are by no means all the social institutions present in society. Social institutions vary from country to country and from place to place. The needs and factors peculiar to each society dictate the institutions that will be formed. Each institution has various functions it performs in the society. Let us use the family institution and the economic institution as examples. The reproduction and care of the young are served by the institutions of marriage and family. Marriage and family also prescribe behaviors expected of husband, father, wife, mother, child, and so on. The marriage and family institution is also required to regulate and control sexual behaviors. The marriage and family institution is also required to regulate and control sexual behaviors in the society. The economic institutions regulate how the resources in the society are sourced and used. It regulates trade and transactions among its members. It provides methods for the production of goods and services and methods of distribution of goods and services amongst others. Do you think that social institutions vary from country to country and from place to place? In one sentence, support your answer. Yes, social institutions vary from country to country and from place to place because the needs and factors peculiar to each society dictate the institutions that will be formed. Functions of social institutions You have read a little about some functions the family and economic institutions perform. We will now touch on the functions of the other four social institutions mentioned in the section above. The educational institution is dedicated to teaching skills and knowledge to members of a society. It also serves as a means of transmitting culture and also a means of preparing individuals for occupational roles. Also. It serves as a means of socializing the members of a society. Religion, as a social institution, performs the function of providing solutions to unexplainable occurrences in the society. It also serves as a means of controlling the natural world. Furthermore, religion plays a role in curbing behavioral excesses among members of the society and also, like the educational institution, serves as an instrument of socialization in the society. The political institutions and legal institutions are embedded in government. One of the major functions of these institutions is the maintenance of law and order in the society. Another function they perform is to protect the society from external threats and protect members of the society. Activity 1. Take a moment to reflect on what you have read so far. Based on your learning experience about Africa and social institutions, mention five distinct ethnic groups in Africa and five different types of social institutions you know. Activity 1. Feedback. Five distinct ethnic groups in Africa are the Madinkas in the Gambia, the Tutsis in Rwanda and Burundi, the Oromos in Ethiopia, the Igbos in Nigeria and the Aousas in Nigeria. Summary of Study Session 1 In Study Session 1, you have learned that 1. The people of Africa are a group of persons of African descent. 2. Social institutions are social arrangements that channel behavior in prescribed ways in important areas of social life. 3. There are five major types of social institutions. 
4. Social institutions have basic functions they perform in society. That ends study session 1. Thank you for listening.